Okay, we are back to episode three now of our Katana follower playthrough. Blind, kind of blind. I had to read some spoiler stuff going on there to figure out where to go and what to do. Um, so yeah, we're just going to have to continue to basically just... There, I yeah, that looks better now. You can see my quest thing is in the right place now. It's not covering my clock and stuff. But yeah, we're just going to have to continue just discovering locations, you know, killing dragons, finding word walls, finding standing stones, all that kind of stuff till things unlock. Um, before we get started here, what I was thinking about while I was adjusting that um, widget and stuff up there off um, on the desktop is because this is like a regard system and I don't know when things are going to unlock, quests are going to unlock, how that's all going to happen. It makes it pretty much impossible to plan out the episodes and stuff here. So because it's basically just a you got to get her regard system high enough and I don't know when that's going to happen, how that's going to happen. Just a little forewarning here. Some of these episodes may be short because I don't want to actually cut an episode off like in the middle of something you know, germane to the mod and all that kind of stuff. So I may have to, in editing and stuff, you know, cut an episode. This is basically just going around collecting standing stones and all that kind of stuff. I may have to cut that episode short because something had popped up for her dialogue to progress her quest missions and stuff further. So I'll, I'll just cut it off so I don't cut into her stuff, basically. So... I don't know how long certain episodes will be, basically. They, they're, some may be normal, some may be really short. I don't know. But that's just how it's going to be, because I can't plan out my episodes if I don't know when her stuff is going to unlock and all that. So, yeah, what we had here is... <clears throat> excuse me. She had this... What's going on? I think what this is, the Katana Eye, is just to do little um, bounties with her. I don't know if that's part of her progressing her main quest or not, so... Katana, I... Do you have time to talk? Sure. What's on your mind? Not really. What's this about? Maybe later. What's on your mind? There's something I need to do. Very cryptic? Go on. This one doesn't have time right now. What is it? Well, I intend to find something that was stolen from me. I thought you might help. Zarilla needs to know more before she agrees. All right, let's get it back. All right, let's get it back. That's it? No questions? Should I ask her some questions? That may get us more backstory. Yeah, let's see what happens. Actually, Cyrilla has some. Hmm. Ask your questions, then. Who stole from you? Someone you don't know. Count yourself lucky. What was stolen? A trinket. But it's important to me. Do you know where it is? In a way, I know who has it. <laughs> it's so funny that she's talking like Gajit. That's all Imperial wanted to know. So, will you help? Yes. I'm glad to hear it, but we can't leave right away. Why not? I'm not sure where to go yet, <laughs> but I have a plan to change that. Okay. Tell Imperial as soon as you know. Let's go. Okay, well, let's keep going for now. This one guesses we shall see if it works. Let's go. There's things to do. Come on. Tell Imperial as soon as you know. Let's go. All right. Started chasing the current. Talk to Katana another time. Can we talk to her right now? Hey there. 
needs you to do something. Could you keep your discipline? Well, okay, oh, that's trade. Da, 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 nothing new. Okay. okay then. So we'll activate that. Um, that stupid unbound. I had to have a, a bat file because that unbound quest when you're running Realm of Lorcan, it never completes. So I just have a bat file for, to complete it. <laughs> Miscellaneous, bring one mammoth test. We'll go grab this and this. We'll go grab these two real quick. I wish this would have been in halted steam camp so we could just got them both in the same place. Um, but yeah, we'll go grab that and that and finish off her stuff. We'll turn that one off. Find Amran's sword. Okay, that put a thing over her head. We might want to turn that off. Okay. Are you ready? Ooh, it's dark. We may have to advance the time here. You there. We're looking for someone in White Run. We will pay good money for information. Shut up. Actually, you know what I should have done? This would be a little bit smarter way to advance the time. Find us in is to go ahead and sleep so that I can level up, even though... I'm going to get so high level without my skills being high level that enemies are going to become like really hard <laughs> because and I do need to advance that. Do I have any debuffs? No. Okay. So let's go ahead and advance that. I guess I could have picked up um, Sadia's quest right there also. Do that. A mage skill to increase. What are we using? Let's increase restoration. Reduce. We're not doing any conjuration. Let's... Um, Lockpicking, we're leveling very fast. Let's do... S no, we're not really doing any sneaking. Um, We'll just do speech. We're not going to pickpocket because that makes her mad anyways. Um, let's do heavy mm. armor and we'll do two handed. We're not okay. <laughs> and we are level thirty five now, and we still well, we have some of these unlocked. going to... Uh, oh, I need to give myself that shout before I forget now that I have dragons unlocked. Um, let's go this way. Grab this one. I guess we've got plenty of skill points. Might as well go this route also. This decapitations, maces, overpowering swords. Okay, sword. That's all that, and let's go ahead and we don't need faces of death. Uh, 
Um, let's go throw some stuff into block for the power bashing. Okay, we'll keep those other skill points there. We could put some more into archery over on this side. But we'll keep that there. Okay, looks good. And my armor level now is 464. So with ebony flesh, that's going to be 564. We're three under capped armor. So we're good there on armor. Um, we need to, though, go ahead and get rid of that since we took the skill we don't need ebony flesh in our okados now if we come across some other things now we have two slots in our okados and we're gonna level up we needed this it's gonna level us up yep 128 let's go grab Talos's blessing so that our shout cooldown is quicker no, I'm not. <laughs> I do have on this profile, um, or this any. Hey, it snowed last night. <laughs> Dang, John, you stand there so much that you melted the snow. <laughs> yeah, that is such a cool mod. You can come out after sleeping overnight and stuff, and hey, it snowed. It's a shame. It's Tell a me we'll grab this. this. This is the guild disciples. Of course. Not What's as many so special these about days. this tree? To the east? Our even its name is an echo. Is there any way to revive the tree? I've thought I think but even if you could get to the end. Where is the tree? You couldn't if you want to you'll have to it's called Nettlebane. I'll get Nettlebane for you. Me. Your spirit it's held in a Hagraven nest called Orphan Rock. Good to see you. You're the best. Here, have some gold. Oh, thank you. Divines, bless your kind heart. Until next okay, time. Okay, grab this. I love you. No, nope, I just want the love. blessing. Even as man, great Talos. Okay, almost 20 hours. It doesn't show how much it reduced it by, but I do know that with, um... Um, Satakal, it basically, Shrine Blessings are 133% based on favor. So it, it gets up to like, I don't remember how high. But it's not only the duration, it does make the shouts even more cool down with doing that. So that's why I like to use that Satakal. But anyways, my my um, speed leveling any here, I have it capped out, I think, at... 60 or maybe 50 for player character level because I mean I was getting up so so dang high and ending up with like 20 30 extra you know perk points and I was like I don't, I don't need that you know because I only use it for um whenever I do playthroughs and stuff for YouTube videos so that I can level my character extremely fast during you know during the thing so I don't need it any higher. I think it's 50 or I might have put it at 60 to cap it at. Okay. We really don't need to go over here to get that mammoth tusk. But I don't remember now, but it may improve her um, disposition to you if you're taking out bandits. and, and But I do know that clearing locations it said raises her disposition towards you okay where are you at there you are Where is she at? I thought she was supposed to teleport to me when she gets too far away. Okay, where are you at? There should be some wolves or skeevers. There they are. Whoa, you just teleported right into that dude. <laughs> Okay, 
I kind of wish she would act more like a rogue and stay back and use like a bow or something. Both of us sitting up here with melee weapons is kind of... I shouldn't have... Oh, that's Boethia cultist, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Oh, I shot him in the head. his book well forgot to put on never nude <laughs> there's that I wonder why some of them lose their clothes and some don't whenever they die dude you're, you're spazzing What? Don't be a huffy puffy. Man, I really need to get rid of that double freaking um, crosshair. Kill him. Her. I, I just... Ever since I switched over to Valhalla Combat... And, you know, the HUD settings, I, I've got this double crosshair now. I've gone through in iHUD and forced disabled crosshairs, and I, I, I don't know how I had it set up when I was using Impa, but I did not have that double crosshair. And now I do it. It's, like, extremely annoying, these double crosshair like that. Sharp axe to cut through all that fat. Time to hit this little game. Why are you missing, dude? Why was that dude missing me? <laughs> okay, we had another dude over here, didn't we? Yeah. Oh, I need a broom, too. Okay, there's that. Get a mammoth tusk. Read books. Ooh, 
What is a Tempest Diminus? I wonder if that's one of the things from Winter Sun. Yep. Favorite day of diminishes 20% slower. Can I wear it? Yes, I can. Even though I'm not worshipping a Daedric Pence, so I don't really need it. I wonder if... I probably won't test it right now, but I wonder if the mod pace, I have it installed right now, will change my um, blocking speed, if there's a, a block speed thing in there. I know it changes weapon speeds and stuff, so you can increase your weapon speed, but I wonder if it does it for block. That would really help with the um, those animations, some of them being so slow. Pace. Weapon speed is going that's gonna be swing speeds. Doesn't look like it. it's just swing speed. Bullet time movement speeds general. Nope, there is no block speed in pace. Oh well. It's gotta keep working on our our timing with it. Okay, the other dude is over there. I guess it'd be cool if a dragon attacked. We need dragon attacks. Because we need dragon souls and stuff. Oh, I still... I need to grab my freaking shout. Okay, who is down there? Is it going to be a cat? Well, there's somebody walking. Land on you. Probably an afflicted, huh? Yeah. Yep. Are you finished ogling the grotesque? I wasn't ogling anything. It's a wolf. And why am I running so slow right now? Okay, before we forget... Save right there. Yeah, it seems like I'm running slower than normal. Trying to blow through this quickly. I 
Ah. Where is the ladder? There it is. I guess I could also do poisons and stuff because it said mixing and using poisons. I couldn't hit her at that angle. Well, probably because I'm still squatting down. But yeah, I could go in and do some poisons and stuff, but... I wonder why my Elden Perry stopped working. Maybe I'm just not getting it timed right. about that. There's a sword, there's that, 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 and that. Um, okay, we'll just... I'll talk to her after I hand those other things in. Yeah, it seemed like a couple of those that I definitely should have had the Elden Perry block, or Elden Perry, off of the time block, but it didn't seem like it gave it to me. Maybe I just wasn't getting it timed right, I don't know. And I don't know why that keeps turn taking off. Yet. 
Is he in Dragon's Reach? Isolde should be out here, right? Once I've made enough money, here's your mammoth tusk. Thank you. As promised, let me show you a thing or two about bargaining. Don't want some shifty merchant giving you a raw trade. You tried mercenary? Work? I have your sword. You found it. Thank you. Here, my father had a favorite sword and shield to. I could use the the one-handed and block anyways, right? There's a rift here in Skyrim. Can't neither magic nor the Okay, so I work with my mother. Sell fruits and vegetables. It's funny. Is that that? Let's see if she's got anything new. Hey there. Nope, nothing new. All right. Um, okay, but we're at the end of this episode, so in the next one, we can either, well, I could, uh, we could grab Sadia's also, um, I always just ignore their conversation so they stay there, it's, it's a habit from, um, Legendary Edition because of vampire attacks, it's, it's helpful to have an extra couple of guys out here to fight them. But it seems like with either Special Edition or Anniversary Edition, I'm not sure which, they took out the um, the Vampire Tax Towns or something like that. I don't know. I've never had one since I've I bought this edition. So I've never. I but I'm just in the habit of never talking to them, so that they, it keeps them there and they don't go away. Then they help Adrian whenever vampires attack, so I can keep Adrian alive. But anyway, so in the next one, we can either go and do the Blessing of Nature. Or we can continue along the lines uh, and go up to do the Greybeards. Um, I don't know. I'll have to. I'll have to think about that, and then I'll have it. Hopefully, I'll have it figured out by the time we start the next episode. But yeah, we're at the end of this episode. So, thanks for watching, and I hope to see you on the next one. Well guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please smash that like button and also consider hitting that subscribe button. Again, thanks for watching and I hope to see you in future episodes.